So there are, you know, in between those who can pay for 10, who can pay for one or two, there are those who can't pay for anyone. And that doesn't mean that those children should be denied education. So what we did was to target. We were, our philosophy is to build the society from the bottom up. So it is those who have been left behind. When you talk about people not being left behind, so it, cre it creates the image that we are all in the queue. But there are some who are not in the queue. And it's the business of government to bring those people in the queue. So our policies under His Excellency John Dramani Mahama, his concern has always been about how does this help the underprivileged. So the policies were crafted on that concern to ensure that we are targeting, that we are bringing people on track, that we're helping those who would otherwise have no chance. There are many, many people right now that the government is taking care of who would have had the chance. There are parents who are now saying, we want to pay. But for me, yes, the money part is important, but the, it's, it's the strategy itself that they may wish to review. For example, how come the school reopen, announcement is gone out, students have left home? and on the middle of the road, or even when they have arrived at the school, now you tell them that, no, go back and come back one month. That's not about money. This cannot be about money, okay? How come in the middle of the term, if the term is extended or cut short? That's not about money. So there are many, many more things that the ministry needs to look at. 